Hello everyone, this is Stevio here, and we are doing some little spring tillage with our 7520. This thing is a beast. Uh, it kind of kills some of the mosquitoes though. It, uh, let's just say we don't have a problem with any mosquitoes around this area. So we got a long day ahead of us chiseling this field, chiseling in the bean ground. We got our uh, Chevy right in front of us here. I thought the John Deere dealer was supposed to meet me on the end of the field here. He was supposed to give me uh, some of the chisel tines he'd replaced, so he was going to bring me one. Hmm. Just chiseling along here. Yep, we will be here for a few hours, let's just say that. Wait a second. Somebody sure is flying down this country road. Wow. I guess I missed them on that side of the field. Yep, that looks like the John Deere dealer. Yep, you're going to have to wait. I'm not going to pick up and go back from now. Look at that John Deere dealer. Keeps his lights on and something. Jeez. Don't know exactly what he thinks he is. I will get there. Just gotta have patience when you're a farmer. Just gotta have patience. Now let's not hit this bush right here. Go around that bush. And down we go. This old beast, it smokes. Ooh, man, it still has the horsepower, though. That's for sure. What the heck? Is this guy calling me? You got to be kidding me. I am just about to the edge of the field. Hold your horses here, buddy. Hold up. All right, I'm just about there. Calm down. Calm down. Everything will be all right if you just take a breather. No time for pleasantries when it comes to that dealer. Hmm. Might want to work on his customer service. Just a thought. Just a thought. All right. So that dealer might have been a little rude, but he actually gave me a huge tip. I don't even know if he really meant to give me this tip or not. He said the other weekend, about maybe a month ago, him and his buddies were out shooting Dove, and they ran upon an abandoned dairy. Uh, it's just right over the hill. He was asking me all about it. He was just like, yeah, yeah, it's uh, old Sam. He passed away probably 10 years ago. Uh, and then he's left it into his uh, girl and boy's name. Uh, I can't remember their name. It's You could just barely see it. It's right over the hill right there. It's not that far. I'm just a little curious. I know it may be trespassing and everything, but I think we're going to take a little trip over there. I just think I might do a little snooping. I know it may be trespassing. I know it may be illegal. Hey, but when you get caught, you just play dumb, right? No, no, no. I think I I pretty much went to school with his boy. So I don't think he's going to have too much of a too much of a problem and of course I'm not going to take anything before I talk to him, but I would like to snoop. Uh and even if I do get caught, I'll just say little Johnny here. I was planning on mowing his ditches and everything like that. And I just kind of started snooping around. Maybe if I play dumb a little bit, I might get away with it. Uh, maybe not. But we're going to take little Johnny here. We were going to end up mowing the ditches around here because they are getting a little bit overgrown. We got the beautiful Duramax here. The HD single cab. I love my Rancho Cattle Guard here. This thing is so beefy. Got a six inch lift with mud tires, aftermarket wheels, hmm, hmm, rock guards with a step on there. You can't beat this type of stuff. We are just going to take a break from tillage here, just because I'm a little curious. 
and why not? Uh, we got all day to till, just as well use our daylight hours, do a little snooping. This is kind of a unique uh, path to the back of this field here. Ooh, got a little roll. I think I may have to work on, look at my shocks there, or my sway bar. Got a lot of roll on this thing. Definitely don't want to have that. Don't think it would be caused by the gooseneck. Alright, gotta go right here. Whoa, 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 wow. I don't know what kind of car that is, but you usually do not see that type of car in the country. Wow, I think I almost lost a little Johnny there. Good thing I'm wearing the brown pants today because that kind of scared me. Speaking about somebody, somebody is right on my butt here. Slow down there, buddy. I guess the John Deere dealership has time to stop and uh, shoot the bull with him, but not me. I take offense to that, buddy. I take offense. So we, uh, we kind of have to take a long way around to get to that area. What do we have here? Oh, that's kind of ridiculous. Uh, yeah, pull him over. Definitely pull him over, buddy. Yep, I would pull him over too. Alright, clear. Uh-oh. This isn't for me, is it? I'll pull over. Okay, not for me. I don't think so. They didn't pull me over. Wow. Definitely have a busy highway today. Look at all the cars coming around. Huh. You could see the way my uh, truck is waving back and forth. Wow. Yeah, I definitely got to look at the shocks or the suspension. I don't know exactly what it would be. Alright, pull right in here. I believe this is the path back. Uh, I hope so. Oh yeah, I see the top of the barn right there. The old red barn in the silo. Is that a few augers out there in the back? It does look like a few augers. Wow. I definitely have a lot of stuff just laying around out here. What did we got? We got... Huh. Okay. I guess they stopped their uh, way from the bridge here. Hmm. I guess this is one way to uh, stop traffic. Just put a whole bunch of objects on the bridge. Wow. Whew. Look how far down that is. Yep, definitely got to use the bridge. You're not going to pass this thing. You are not going to pass, uh, at least in a vehicle or bicycle. Yeah, you might be able to lift a bicycle over or horse, eh, but probably won't deal with a horse either. Wow, that is quite the ditch running right beside. I'm surprised they can have it dairy. Maybe that's because it's shut down. The code and everything too close to a possible creek waterway. Got a couple pallets. What do we have over here? Is this an old international? Old international. Narrow front, huh? 1456. Farmall. Wow. That is... Uh, unique looking international. I don't think you'd find many of these. Another inner is this an international McCormick International drill here? Look like an old uh, silver cedar before they made the gleaners. Maybe. Wow, look at that truck. Don't want to go too close to that. I, I smell something stinky. Got a old bus out there. 
we got out over here? We got an uh, auger uh, graveyard here. Yep, looks like maybe an auger boneyard. This is where they uh, went to be parted out. Yeah, I bet the sheet metal is either thin or they just uh, weren't big enough for them to use. An old silage wagon there. Old, what is that noise? It sounds like bees. Got an old uh, hole dug in the ground there. Whew. Yep. Yep, just think. When them uh, horse flies land on you, what they've been touching right prior to that. Stay away from the horse fly. They definitely hurt. I like this rake here. Little three point uh, side rake there. That would be nice. Definitely. Now, this I saw. I'm surprised they didn't get this into a barn. We got a Mack truck here. Fairly nice inside. <laughs> not gonna start up for us that's too bad nice looking truck though very nice wow they cut this cab down just to fit under this overhang no I don't know exactly what this John Deere is it looks like maybe a 50 20 cab or a 50 20 or 40 20 hood it's got some lights on it. Definitely put some uh, new front tires on it. Man, that is a different looking cab. I don't even know how do you get into this thing. You gotta be from the back. Man, do I have to shimmy up in there? Beside? This is odd. What? Uh, 30. 530. I have never heard of that. Never heard of that. That is definitely something you don't see every day, this tractor. Huh. Old battery just sitting beside there. Oh, what is that? Interstate battery, maybe? Uh, power battery? It looks like they left a few of their st uh, stuff around in here. Hmm. Yep, got a few parts probably. Got some WD-40, some off. You don't need that off can when you're driving my smoking tractor chiseling. Let's just say that. Uh, this tractor don't want to start. Hmm. Look at that deer symbol. Ugh. Hood ornament and everything. It's a little bit different. I'll say that. Can't say I hate it, but I don't know if I love it. Huh. That's definitely a different looking tractor. What is this? 87-ish? This is probably one of my favorite looking Fords out there. I mean, I have a lot of favorite Fords, but this thing, I have always liked the looks of this Ford. And... Wow, they really did a... This looks like it was part of the farm the repair truck. We got M Miller Welder in the back there. Maybe you can read it. I kind of have to look closely. It took me a while. Uh, I think it says financial mistake on the back of that window. I don't know why. Look at that uh, MIG Welder. Whew. Wouldn't mind having the welder, and I wouldn't mind having this truck. Definitely unique truck. Have to say, definitely like that truck. What do we have here? A C10, maybe? 66-ish? About? And it's lowered. That's too bad they lowered it. Not my cup of tea. Definitely looks like they might have sprayed some white dump some white paint on it maybe only dump some white paint in the back there is this on airbags 
This may be on air base. Let's see if I can get this thing a running here. Is anybody coming down the road yet? Don't see anybody. Hope no one comes down. Oh, there it goes. It starts up. All right, now we're. Oh, look at that. Thing raises up. Not my cup of tea, but uh, I kind of like it, to be honest. Look at this go kart we got here. Now, this would be fun if I can get this thing to run. Oh, yeah, this is going to be fun. But thank you all for watching, and I will see you later over here in Wisconsin. Uh oh. Uh oh. That doesn't look good. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share, and subscribe. gonna jump the ditch and try to outrun him. Oh no! Oh, 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 oh man! Uh oh! Oh no! We're stuck.